Hello, X Horse fans. X Horse is bringing a new experience for MQB instrument data reading with our brand new bundle of MQB 35X X adapters, which will save automotive locksmiths from the intricate and annoying soldering, pin lifting, and wire cutting work. In today's video, we'll talk about how to read BGA type D70F3532 data using Key Tool Plus and the newly released MQB35XX adapters. On the main screen, tap on MO Programming. Scroll down to VW. Select by type and select MQB Instrument MO System. Enter the MQB48 NEC35XX lock and tap on Start Programming. Please read the disclaimer on the screen carefully and then tap on OK. Make sure Key Tool Plus has connected to the network. Then we are going to select Programmer Reads Files. Read NEC35XX chip and we are tap on Adapter Methods. Select D70F3532. Take a careful look at the connection diagram and operate following the diagram. Locate the positioning points and we're going to connect the adapter to the board with reference to the points. Connect and apply the clips. Note, make sure the pins aim right at and keep good contact with the points. Otherwise, the following errors may occur. Crystal oscillator frequency configuration failed. There is a problem with the contacts. Please reinstall the adapter. Chip cracking failed. First, the contacts are loose. Second, continue reading repeatedly. Now we're gonna connect the adapter to Key Tool Plus with a DB15 cable. Power it up using a power supply. Tap on Read. Make sure the adapter and the chip are well connected and press Continue to start the operation. Tap on Show Lock to unfold details and tap on Close to fold the locks. Reading succeeded and we are going to save the data. The MO data can be used to generate dealer key and for key learning. Press Obtaining MO data to load and upload the NEC35XX chip file read by the programmer. Select the data we just saved. Decide whether the instrument type requires external EEPROM 95320 to be loaded. This instrument requires no reading and loading EEPROM 95320, so we tap on No to start the calculation. It's gonna take 5 to 10 minutes to complete the calculation. Thank you for watching, and let us know if you have any questions. I'll see you in the next video.